Let's see. All right. We are recording. So, um, you consider yourself one of the protesters? Yes. And why are you protesting? Because um, this is a very, very precious chance for Hong Kong people to speak out where they consolidated 17 years of the unhappiness of the Chinese government's ruling Hong Kong. They are using every kind of dimension to force Hong Kong people to agree what they agree, which the majority of Hong Kong don't. They passed the bill in the Legislative Council. Uh, they're using their system, like two-thirds of the majority, but two-thirds is exactly what they are their pro-government's party to the, the majority are the pro-government pro uh, majority. So no matter what bill they try to pass at the Legislative Council, they will get it. Like the so-called high-speed railway, we don't accept it. All the local elected uh, legislators are against it. They still get it passed. Now, it's been two years after the deadline. We don't know how many two years to be complete. And it's already 60 billion over budget. <laughs> and we don't know how many 60 billion going to be over budget. Besides, Hong Kong people don't take trains. They, took, they take planes everywhere, a couple of hours. Why we spend eight hours on the, on the train, which costs almost half of the um, ticket price, I mean air ticket price. Why do we need that? We don't, right? Similar, similar thing happening for the last 17 years that all the Hong Kong Chinese or Hong Kong people swallow, swallow, swallow. And today is the time they speak out peacefully with a, you know, very tidy manner that you can't find on earth. Yeah. They call it riot. I think whoever you're listening to this video or audio yeah. know what they mean by riots, like Belfast, yeah. like, you know, I'm not trying to name anything. Sure. In <laughs> sure. But let's say... We've like, had riots in the States. Yeah. And <laughs> like the um, uh, okay, Hurricane Katrina yeah. hitting Louisiana. Right? Yeah. And looting. And the first, first thing Barack Obama administration do is sending the troops. Yeah. See how peaceful these people are. Yeah. We just speak out. All right. Here is the thing. The people try to think of a better solution of how the 2017's chief executive election. Now. The Chinese government, okay, we have a very funny example. Let's say we are under a very old-fashioned uh, mind parents. Or, okay, you are a daughter of them. You are supposed to be uh, having an arranged uh, marriage. Now, okay, you have your own, own choice, but you can only have three choices. Right. One of them is 80 years old. <laughs> one of them is 90 years old, one of them is 100 years old. You can choose either one of them. You happy? No. Exactly. Yeah. This is what we fight for. Yeah. All right? And I hope whatever I just try to express can make you understand we are not crazy people. We are just a peaceful humble citizen of Hong Kong try to get what we deserve. Are you a student? No, I'm 45. I'm just checking. It seems like the protest is led by students. Yes. And But you've joined are, in. I'm not joining them. I'm trying to protect them. You're trying to protect them? Yeah, I'm just observe. See, is there anyone, you know, trying to do undercover to harm them? Yeah. And you're... Um, Tactics. And uh, will you say what you're a resident of? China. And no, I'm a Hong Kong Chinese. Okay. But I got a premises in China. Okay. So that makes it more dangerous for you to yes. be here. Yes. So I try not to show it on the cameras. Yes. So are you? Do you feel safe right now? Yes, I'm very safe. Okay. We got seven million of us here. 
Yeah. <laughs> Are you worried what the Beijing will do? To be honest, I believe the communist administration will not let the children, I mean the student, get what they want. I believe, I hope, I hope not, but I believe some but gonna be shared here in Hong Kong one day in a very near future. Once I got chance, I will try here to you know to, to protect them. No matter just one cut, my I mean one cut less than it's supposed to be. I'm happy. Yeah. And uh, yeah, we children. I mean student have no any politics politics burden. What they requesting are very pure and simple and humanity. Why we fight for it? Yeah. Very natural request. Yeah. Everyone want to move forward. We don't want living back to like seventies where we have zero democracy. Yeah. So you think blood is going to be shed to? Yeah. Before this is over. Yeah. Uh, I don't see. I, I, to be honest, I can't foresee any any peaceful. I, I don't see any any unless, peaceful solution. Unless Beijing in. just gives in, if Beijing says okay, you can elect your I executive. I think communists will say okay for you know putting their face down. Yeah, no, but outside of that, there's going to be bloodshed because the students you don't think are going to go away. You don't think yes. a protest is going to end. Yes. And then eventually, what, what 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 the Chinese government doing now is use the citizen to against the citizen. Yeah, how are this they doing is, that? This is, you know, we we know communists for like the last sixty years. We know their history. They will not beat up the uh, citizen themselves. They will let the uh, the citizen they beat up themselves. Just what last last Friday you can see they've been paid to do it. Yeah. You can tell. Yeah. But that didn't seem to work. That didn't... Uh... Of course. If you pay 1,000 bucks, I mean 1,000 people here to build up the student, 10,000 will show up. Yeah. So that means they're probably going to change tactics and... Yeah. Now they try <laughs> to, you know, uh, they use their uh, PR uh, tactics, try to, you know, wave them down. I don't know how, but... Yeah. I don't think people will you know, back off just like that. Yeah. But it depends on depends on the Chinese government, really. Yeah. So you think? One more question. So you yeah. think the? Um, I mean, they could either come with a big squad of riot police, or the military, or something like that. If they go with military, I don't think they have any any uh, excuses. <laughs> To be still with the, you know, the Earth Village. Yeah. I don't think they can still part of it. Yeah. So military will not be considered, but I think Hong Kong police will be uh, using some like rubber bullet. Yeah. And unfortunately, some rubber bullet kill someone. Yeah. This is how the blood shed. Yeah. Well, thank and, you. And they, they, and at the end of the day, they're gonna claim, oh, tough shit. <laughs> right. Right. You know. All right. Uh, thank you so much. No problem.